helicopter blade, helicopter blade, helicopter blade, helicopter blade, helicopter blade. Curse flash. Seller Productions presents The Revenge of BD. Like, don't move, Porky! <sighs> what the hell's your problem, woman? I was just polishing up the last of the chocolate mousse. <coughs> the last of the chocolate mousse, you bitch! I didn't think you would mind. Didn't think I would mind. You, you hussy. I was saving that for tomorrow to eat while watching Star Trek. I thought you were on a diet. Or did your last boyfriend consider thunder thighs a term of endearment? Why, you... Uh, uh, oops. Uh, uh, oh, 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 shit. Uh, uh, Mario, is everything set for my secret meeting? Yes, boss. Only you and his staff will be there. You've done well, my little runt, and uh, if Capone hadn't been bumped off, I'd get you a lower monthly payment on your house. Let's get this job over with. Yes, sir. Mary, mother of God! Oh. I'm afraid she won't be much help now. Who the hell are you? And, and why would you murder all these tiddlywink assemblers? They tried to stop me, but I am being rude. I am Colonel B.D. Andrews of the Anti-Unification Forces. B.D. who? Andrews, don't play games with me. You know why I'm here. I'm looking for Shogo Yahagi. He has one of my toys, and I want it back. You're a madman. I don't know any Shogo. Maybe this demonstration will help to jog your memory. Uh, Mario! My tweed suit! Shh! Bless you! Yeah, thanks to you, I'm uh, dying of pneumonia. You know, like, you really shouldn't hide in the fridge. <laughs> Yeah, good advice. Changing the subject, what do you think Ryan wants? He probably wants to marry you again, like for sure. Over my dead body. 
That can be arranged. Up with friends like you, uh, who means enemies. You know you still like him. Like, totally. I do not. No! Ryan Ayers is quite possibly the most arrogant, conceited asshole I've ever met. Yeah, but you were stupid enough to marry him. I'm right, huh? Aren't I? Aren't I? I made a mistake! Journey, look out for the moose! Like, if one more person tries to impress me with their Susanna Hoffs impression... Yeah, Ryan, like, no more games. Fine. Luigi is missing. We've received no message concerning his whereabouts in the last 24 hours. We believe he may have fallen victim to foul play. So what he's trying to say is, um... Luigi's in trouble! And now it's springtime for Hitler and Germany. Land is happy and gay. We're marching to a faster pace. Look out! That's a big twinkie. A laser, Doctor Scott, capable of emitting a beam of pure antimatter that will slice, dice, or circumcise. This ain't no twinkie. So. So unless you tell me where Shogo and my Bahamut 6 are, I will neutralize that tiny island out there. But you can't. There's a creation con going on and Sve Masek's making a speech on button making. Ah, Sve Masek, whose husband Carl was brutally murdered after he hacked up my favorite movie, Megazone 2-3, to make Robotech the retold story. I told you I don't know who this Shogo guy is and I don't know why you want him so bad. He has something of mine. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what, what is that? Where's... Oh, huge glitch on this tape. It's all over for us. Goddamn video glitch. There, that ought to fix it. Anyway, if my demands aren't met within 14 hours, I will destroy your city completely. And just to show you that I'm not joking, I will demonstrate. You know, you are far too trusting. He's being held at the Tiddlywink factory. Well, that's where he said he was going before he left. Ryan should be figuring this out, um, right about now. Girl! I just got this. David Kidder, also known as Colonel B.D. Andrews, escaped today from the Bonsai Institute of Mental Health. So this has some meaning, I... He used to work for Parker Brothers. Huh? You know the game company? Bitch. That's where Luigi is. B.D. has taken Luigi Italiano hostage and is demanding... Jesus! Two hundred million dollars, something called the Bahamut Six, and Robotech Two rights. He has the ultimate weapon and will blow up the world in, let's see now, less than 14 hours from now. 14 hours?! You realize that the fate of the entire world rests in your hands. Well, what if we fail? Um... Well? BD will destroy the Earth, plain and simple. His cannon comes straight out of the Star Wars saga. What are you gonna do?! I'm not gonna do anything! You girls are. You must infiltrate the complex and kill BD. Like chick you suck in the stealth department. Who says I was sneaking around, you dumb bimbo? I do, because Ryan says it was going to be a tough job. What, just because BD has turned Parker Brothers into a paramilitary complex? With guards and attack dogs? Hey, it shouldn't be a problem, you know. Do you think Ryan knows what's going on? Well, do you think Ryan's ever had a firm grasp on reality? He had a firm grasp on your ass. <gasps> Achoo! What, you bitch! God! <laughs> 
This has got to be Ryan's stupidest idea yet. Who the hell's going to believe that there are tigers in Canada? Didn't you charm him out of this idea? Lay off the Ryan stuff. Oh, touchy subject. Look, I just don't want to hear about him anymore. You lust after him. Oh, yeah? What about Sean? Oh, Sean? Uh, you mean Sean up. He moved to New York, you know, to better himself. Yeah, right. He knew it all right. And they found him in the back of the of the big naked with 15 other men. Yeah, but they were nice men. You know, like the kind you would bring home to your mother or something. Yeah, sure. Oh, hey, good. Come check out what I shot. Hurry ah. up, you guy. Spiders. Afraid of a little spider, Dr. Jones? <laughs> Goody, what's the hold up? Goody, a deadly leper spider! Don't move. You know what happens if it stings you? Yeah, your limbs fall off. Don't make any sudden moves. Don't move, slut puppy. You're under arrest. Come on out of there. Thanks for the lift. Shut up. I'm sorry, jeez. Now, if you two boys are good, we might consider letting you live. But if you piss us off, then... No, we, we Never. wouldn't do that. Actually, it's like my time of the month, so, well, off you go. I like those two. Too bad they have to die. The track! Oh, Chetsky! Robotech will be right back. Oops, wrong show. I'm afraid your two lady friends won't be able to help you anymore. I've made quite sure of that. What do you mean? They're dead, don't you get it? Kick the bucket. I think you underestimate him, you chump. Kay and Yuri can be quite resourceful. I doubt if they could survive a hundred foot fall and my favorite pet alligator, TikTok. <laughs> What's so funny? You're such an asshole. Who do you think you are? Crocodile Dundee? I'm sure your alligator pet will make a nice pair of boots for Yuri. Well, we'll just see about that, won't we? Like, if you would stop sneezing, we wouldn't get caught half as much. You can just smooch my big white butt, pucker up, buttercup. Like, what are you going to do, flash your tits? I'm going to use my natural charm. Sex. What do you think of these hooters? Oh, damn. Oh. Huh. Yeah! Hey, stop. Well, who opened the blast doors? Bingo! It doesn't look good. Well, that's pretty bloody obvious. Try to find out where he is on that monitor. According to this, he's on level 7G. Level 7G, huh? That sounds so familiar. So, up there is level 7. If we sneak up through the back stairs, then climb through the ventilation grid, we should be able to rescue him within the remaining two hours. No, no, no. We only have one hour left. Jeez, we'll just take the elevator. You're on drugs. You're the one that's on drugs. I hope you get lost. 
Look, you're the one that's gonna get lost, you bitch, so just go that way. <sighs> Yuri! Hmm. Well, what are you waiting for? Don't just stand there. I'm not! I'm leaving! Go, be gone with you! Ah. Your government has just about run out of time. You'll never get away with this, you sicko commie bastard. Shut up. So, you managed to live. Surprised you, didn't I? Oh, Luigi! Should I? I'll have the ultimate weapon, total control of the government, women to call my own. I don't think you're in a position to negotiate. Personally, I think you're just a big flaming homosexual with an ego problem. You probably can't even get it up. Why, you cheap hussy? God damn it. A clever maneuver. my lips. <laughs> Bimbo saved the world from BD's tyranny. Gee, Gee thanks, thanks a lot. lot. Boy, we have to get out of here. BD had tons of guards. No kidding. I really don't think you're in a position to be smart with me. Listen, without me, you'd be nothing. Without nothing. us, you'd be dead. So shut up, you stupid wop. I want to raise Luigi. Oh, if I can't rule the world, then there will be no world to rule. I would hate to go back on my word. Okay, I think we're all gonna uh, die. It's closing time. There's got to be a way out. <gasps> this isn't working. No, really, what would your first do? What are you girls doing, you bimbos? There's no way out. This place is going up like an atom bomb. Open up, damn it. Okay. Oh, gosh, girl. Did you even just try the button marked open? Oh, I get it. It's an escape module. Too bad it'll only hold one. It'll hold the equivalent of 400 pounds. I don't think between the three of us we weigh that much. I don't know, Kay, after all that chocolate mousse. Oh, shut up, bitchy. Okay, come on, Luigi, we are going. God damn it, Kay, you're too fat. Fine, I'll get out then. Get back in there. No, you. Ah! 
gonna die. Okay. Okay. No way. We have to destroy it. You don't even know if that will even work. There may be another way. There is no other way. The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Ugh. If this doesn't work, then I will just see you in hell, my friend. has been saved, but at what cost? Curse you, Colonel B.D. Andrews! Yuri? Yuri?